Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Friday the 28th of September where I set up just one of our signals from our members area from stocks signals for the fifth wave trade in the members area. Our members get to choose from potential short and long fifth wave trades on the 60 minute, the daily and the weekly time frame. For example, in the long fifth wave trades today, I'm going to go for a shorter time frame. Uh, click on the image here, download the spreadsheet. This spreadsheet looks like this today. I've chosen 60 minute again, I did yesterday. And also, if you look at the bottom of the spreadsheet, we have a weekly and daily potential fifth wave trades for today. I've chosen one of these on the 60 minute time frame. So let's have a look on the chart. I've chosen NE, really cheap stock, energy stock here. Closed at 681 yesterday. We've had a really good move up on the 60 minute chart here on NE. Uh, down the lows here around about September the 7th, where I've isolated. Then we've had a wave one, a wave two, a wave three, and a wave four. This is the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from wave5trade.com for the Ninja Trader NT8 platform. It's also available for TradeStation, multi charts, and in a minute you'll see the Think or Swim version. Just wanted to see, show you the overview of this current trend that we're in on this intraday time frame. We've pulled back on the wave four, and that's what we're interested in right now. So let's have a closer look on the Think or Swim version. So this is the Think or Swim version. Uh, we've uh, zoomed in a little bit here. Just talk about this wave four pullback. This is what we're after, and this is pulled back into our automated probability zones in the green zone. So if it holds here and starts to move away, we've got an 85% probability it's going to go on and make that new fifth wave high up into our uh, target zone here, around about the top end of it, 750. So good, um, good support level there in our probability zones. The next thing we do is measure the performance of this wave four pullback. And the first of the two subcharts uh, at the bottom here uh, is the oscillator, the 535 oscillator. That's pulled back between 90 and 140. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Now the next one is our stochastic. If we look here, we've got this false breakout bar at the top here. So this denotes a really strong bullish trend. We've pulled back against that trend, crossed over in the oversold zone, and the likelihood is it wants to return to that main bullish trend and start printing some more yellow dots on the top there. So we've got to just look for the entry here. Now this is a cheap stock guys, so um, whether you want to stay away from this on a Friday, I don't know, but if it goes, it goes. So uh, I've gone for a very conservative entry here. One of the entry strategies that we talk about uh, in our training boot camps is the, the 6-4 moving average high, part of our indicator suite here. We need to be above that for the first hour of today's um, session, and it's way above there, my 702 entry. We're above the whole $7 mark, above the highs of yesterday here, and also above this pivot point high there. So 702 is my entry. One cent below the wave four low here is the stop loss, 672. And then the target, um, top end of the target is only 750. That gives a risk reward of one to 1 1.6. However, if it does reach these highs on the way three around about the one to one around 730 and it see shows signs of exhaustion uh, and you know just get out take the profit um, it's not always necessary to reach the target on a Friday it may not even trigger today it may be carried over to Monday let's see what the price action is today oil at the moment looks pretty strong uh, as I'm making this video during the European session oil seems to be above the close of yesterday so looking reasonably strong so we could get a bit of a push on this today so 702 entry for NE on the 60 minute time frame target around 750 stop loss just below the wave 4 at 672 so that's it for today have a great trading day a great weekend speak to you all on Monday